Bill and I have decided that we are going into the, into the trenches. We're going into the mud. We're going into the fire to help pour, pull these kids out and help them out. If you don't know what a sober living house is, a sober living house is a house where you can go and you can live with people that are suffering from the same illness that you're living with, that you can be safe, that you can have a room of your own and a bed to sleep in, where the person that's sitting next to you isn't judging you because the person that's sitting next to you did exactly the same thing that you did. Stephen told me that he couldn't stand to go out in public anywhere because he felt that everyone had known his sins. They could see right through him. And no matter how many times he took a bath, no matter how pretty his clothes were, his hair was done, everyone could see the sin that he had done. Sober living houses are so important because it gives all of these people a chance to, tra to, to transition back into society with people that aren't judging them, where they can sit down and say, hey, remember, uh, you look, I did this and I'm feeling really bad about it. And that person can tell them, listen, I did the same thing. It's okay. We'll get through this together.